Oh, just a we are doing into week number weekend number two of what we're calling the Cajon Crawl. Uh, here's some video from not that so much, but what we saw a moment ago might stop for some salad on the way. Keep panic at bay here. We do have breaking news right now. Facebook is down. We're expecting this to, uh, you know, trend on Twitter any moment. Here's the screen grab we have from our newsroom where people are unfortunately having trouble getting on. I got on, but nothing's uploading. Nothing is updating. It just allowed me to send a friend request. That's all. And in all seriousness, on Twitter, yeah, I just went and checked. Yeah, uh, right now, hashtag Facebook down, trending. Facebook says they're working on getting it fixed soon. How about that? What did you think about the ride? It was great. And apparently, I've never been on live television before, but apparently sometimes I don't watch the sh I don't watch the news because I'm a kid, and apparently every time, apparently Grandpa just gives me the remote after we watch the Powerball. It's the Powerball. <laughs> Tell me about the ride. What did you think about the ride? Well, it was great. Why? Because apparently you're spinning around, and apparently every time you get dizzy. Yeah. That's all you do is get dizzy. Is it fun? Yeah. And I've never, ever been on live television. I never, ever be on live television. Are you excited? Yeah, and apparently I only went down the super slide. When I went down the wall, I was scared half to death. I just freak out. And the pub's still spilling over onto the streets. They are absolutely in full voice. I'm sure you can hear it. You can see the red and green behind us. This pub, I've only seen a couple of people leave here in the last hour, and that's because they were going to get Bunnies tattoos on their arms, Premiership tattoos. So, look, as you can see, pretty happy. All about the Bunnies down here. Public holiday in Sydney. I think this party, though, it'll be a week off work for everyone. <laughs> Right now, Ruth Sterling, who is the festival coordinator, is on site here uh, and is being, uh, uh, well, she's not letting me do my job and to report to you. She would not like me to tell you what is going on at Keene State, State College. Now I'm being called a free stater. This is a family-friendly event. The footprint of Keene Pumpkin Festival is 100% safe. We have a bigger crowd than we've ever had. I want them to have a wonderful evening and not be disturbed by people who aren't even at the Pumpkin Festival. So if you think that inciting these people is a good idea, I am going to pull the plug on you because you are here as a guest of Keen Pumpkin Festival and I assigned you this spot. You heard it here first, everybody. Do not alarm our guests. Thank you. When you report the news, when you report the reality, the people in charge want to shut you down. This is against freedom of the press, folks. We have been bringing you coverage all day. Yes, Ruth is correct that this festival is very important for Keene. We have been reporting that all day long. Then pull the plug. But pull the plug. Agency, and you have no right to self-promote here, darling. I'm not self-promoting anything. Yes, you are. Do we agree he's self-promoting? I agree. Yeah. Everybody, Ruth Sterling, the festival organizer of the Keene Pumpkin Festival censoring local media from the truth of what is happening outside the footprint. More on this to come in uh, just a minute. Lucas, go with come? him. Lucas is going to escort me to Speak do directly into my tie. All right, this so I'm going to talk into his tie. I wish we could see this right now, because this is great. All right, here we go. Let's start out with... <laughs> we are really close right now. Come under the weather wall. Come over here. All right, so this is what we did on our walk. I'm talking into no, his tie. I got the microphone inside. right there. So early morning, did you see the lightning out there? Did you I see did. That? I did. Had a little bit of lightning, a little bit of thunder out there. We're going to take that off real quickly. Right now, looking outside, there's a live view from <laughs> our rose state camera. Am I still in the shot? Am I still in the shot? Here, I think you're good. As long as you stay there, I think you're good. So let's talk about the weather here. Clear skies right now. We're going to have some clouds later. going to have some showers and thunderstorms. <laughs> Step out the way. 75 degrees are.